Hello everybody, I am of course the Invertibarian. Thank you ever so much for joining us here today on the channel. If you are new, please of course consider subscribing. And if you've been here for a while, thank you ever so much for all your support. So in today's video, we are opening a box from the Spider Shop. Woohoo! Now it is getting towards the end of the year. The Spider Shop have withdrawn all livestock from their website. Most other retailers will be doing pretty much the same because the weathers are now hitting minus temperatures. So this will probably be the last unboxing for quite a considerable time. Um, but without further ado, let's unbox a box from the Spider Shop. <laughs> Before we crack on with the unboxing, please of course remember there's an affiliation link down in the comment section of this video. If you're buying from the Spider Shop, be it livestock or accessories, please do consider using my uh, code that's listed down there. Before we crack on with the video, of course, I would like to say give a huge shout out to Mitch and Gav. Mitch at the Unseen Universe and Gav at Impossible Inverse. The two of them are working tirelessly throughout the course of uh, the month of December from the 1st up until the 25th, bringing amazing charity raffles. If you want to be a part of it, go and check out the Unseen Universe. It is an absolutely amazing, incredible thing he's doing. And I can't imagine how much hard work and effort has gone into bringing this awesome opportunity for you to win prizes whilst do some good and raise money for an awesome charity so please do consider going over to the unseen universe on facebook instagram uh, his youtube channel and check out what he's been up to and it's never too late to join in and raise some some money for charity so well done mate love you absolutely love you and gav on with the unboxing so basically this box uh, my behavior in for in once more. Uh, this box was a wee gift to myself, not only is it December, but also uh, it was a gift to celebrate the buying of my house. This house is now my home. It was always my home, but now it is legally my home. It's my house. I own this this wonderful place, uh, which we call it's home. All, it's almost, it's all the house. Yep. We own the house. What do we see? We own the house! Woohoo! We own the house! So this little box was a gift to myself to celebrate the owning of the house. And uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah! You're so silly. You're so silly, Daddy. First up, we have the Damascus Orc Manny, also known as the Orange Legged Trapdoor Spider. These guys are absolutely beautiful. Originating from Thailand, can be found throughout Japan, China, and Southeast Asia. An adult specimen can reach around 7 centimeters leg span. Temperatures, lower end 20 to 23 ish, uh, and humidity, nice high humidity, around 89%, which will be easily done through uh, spray and mist in. Sort of humid damp substrate. The original setup I did for this one I really wasn't happy with. It was looking a bit bland. You can kind of see it here a couple of bits of sphagnum moss and a hole in the ground. So I decided to take it out before I unbox it properly. Take it out, get it out, get it out, wished, and pop it in a wee tub uh, so we can try and get a look at it before we put it into its updated and kind of more stylized. Sadly, the footage I got isn't that great. It's the, the images are a bit kind of grainy. I'm using a rubbish old uh, camera phone here because my other one broke. And, uh, if you want, 
better, clearer, clarity uh, images, head over to Scott's Inverts. He's got some really nice uh, pictures, uh, video of his when he unboxed his. But what we did is we got it into the home. I kind of redid it because I want to look a bit more natural and something to be to look at because, let's face it, from here on in, it is a tub of dirt. So we may as well make it mildly aesthetically pleasing to look at. Um, so yeah, what we did is we got into his home and popped on a wee time lapse and tried to follow it around and see just exactly what it'll do when it finds that sort of beginner borrow I created for it. And here is that footage of the time lapse spider. <laughs> Now on to the second spider we got in the box. This is a species I've looked at many a times and it happened to come up on the spider shop so I immediately grabbed one. Uh, it's gone into a real horrible uh, temporary tub for just now which will be getting uh, changed out just as soon as I possibly can because I just don't like it. It just doesn't look nice but needs are a must for just now. Anyway, uh, let's go and have a look at our number two spider. <laughs>
for amazing feed. The speed wrapping of that spider is just phenomenal. That fly did not stand a chance. It was like, and you're done. That is just absolutely blowing my mind away, the speed in which it did that. Agriope, uh, just amazing but anyway that is it this is us at the end of this video thank you so much for taking the time to watch this i'm really happy with probably the last two editions of the year as i say all the shops are starting to wind down now because the temperatures outside are far too dangerous for shipping mixing to that postal strikes it's just far too risky so i'm ever so grateful i got my file box from the spider shop Anyway, that is it from me to you. Thank you ever so much for watching. Let me know what you think of these spiders in the comment section down below. Are you now thinking about sort of keeping your eyes out for these uh, once the weather starts to warm up again? Anyway, pop your comments down below. Thank you, every single one of you, and we shall see you again soon, hopefully. Be good, be kind, take care of yourselves, and don't forget to check out all the channels that have been mentioned throughout the course of this video. Thank you ever so much, and goodbye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye.